Yes, guys, it's back on going to some more of the Lunar Nerd Show. This episode is called Lunar Spots Nebula Back on Earth in VR Chat. I'm excited to get to see Nebula again. I'm so excited. Yay. Alright. Three, two, one, go. Okay. Also, sorry I'm making this video super uh, later in the day. Um, yeah, I was on my, uh, Oh yeah, grandparents, yeah. And out. Doing some yoga? Breathing exercises? Oh, look at the ear. Aww. Just feel the star power. You don't gotta do anything with it, just keep it in control. Keep it in control. Yes. You just gotta keep staring at me, or? <laughs> yeah. yeah. Are you talking to me? <laughs> yeah, Nebula. Oh, I thought you couldn't see me. <laughs> I uh, barely. Mm, that's a shame. You're kind of <laughs> bright. So you I seem to be. She kind of does blend in a little bit. Not a whole lot, but a little bit. Hey, everything Luna, okay? Luna. Yes, everything is quite fine, Luna. How are you doing? Fine. Where have you been? Busy. <laughs> Busy. Busy? Okay. Busy being... I have people to, uh, appease. Yeah. The most oh, the monster is out here. <laughs> All right, three, two, one, go. Right, you work for those two. Yes, I do. Does that mean um, they're here? Don't you be worried. I cannot confirm or deny anything. Okay. <laughs> okay. Um... I'm Why excited to see Taurus, actually. I was told to, uh, keep an eye on you. Watch you. How long have you been doing that? It's been periodic. Oh, okay. For a few weeks. Oh. That's oh. creepy. That's not- well, that's not creepy at all. problem? <laughs> well- I was gonna say, that's creepy. not creepy at all, in a sarcastic way. It's yeah. not for prolonged periods of time. Still weird. Yeah. I guess it is weird for you. Correct. It's not strange for us astros to check in on each other every now and then. Yeah. Well, I'm... Technically, I don't qualify for one of you yet, so... I suppose you don't. Smart of you to say that. Yeah. I would rather not be smited by Taurus or something. I don't know what he can do. Really think he's going to be that aggressive to you? Yes. I've been told on multiple accounts to just be careful, so. Oh, yes, because Taurus has a reputation to uphold. Yeah. Yeah, so, uh, the threat of him killing me it seems real. Lunar, you've given no reason to kill you. There was literally a trial on whether or not to kill me. Yes, and you won. In a technical sense. Yes. Taurus is here to see if you're still doing what you're supposed to be doing. Yeah, that's still scary. Have you not been doing what you're required to do? I literally am here training. Yes, I'm doing breathing. I literally only thing. come here to train. I feel like I should tell you that we astrals are very... I guess on Earth you call it Type A. What? <laughs> we stick to agreements. Right. Okay. What I'm um, trying to say is that the probability of finding a loophole to kill you is rather small. 
That's good. But yeah. if you want to be scared, that probability is still there. Yeah. Yeah. I was also told he might egg me on to get a reason. So. We haven't had another astral body in many years. Yeah, okay, so, yeah, what I'm getting here is, uh, like, Taurus would, like, I guess you can say, egg, uh, on Lunar to, like, get him killed. Yeah. <laughs> I don't think I would want to be face-to-face -face with Taurus if he is that aggressive as they say he is. I mean... I guess what I'm gonna sound like, I don't think he's gonna be, like, that aggressive, but he might as well be. I mean, isn't, like, Taurus, like, the bull, or whatever, like, the bull constellation? Whereas, like, we all know that Leo is a lion, so, think what I'm saying. If you want to get all astrology, science or whatever, if you want to get astrology involved, then, yeah. Sometimes I do, whenever I'm outside, sometimes I will look at the stars, you know, see if I can see the Big Dipper or Small Dipper. Many is a number for you to, uh, quantify. Yeah. Save. Millions. Well, I was told there wasn't anybody like me, so... Yeah, exactly. But for new stars born, that hasn't happened since we were created. Oh, wow. Well, so, oh. what, like, billions? Years? Huh. So, that's kind of why along with other things that have been happening in this galaxy. Right. Uh. Hmm. But yeah, how much do you guys know about? I know about a lot of things, Lunar. I'm just a messenger. Cool, cool, cool. Yay. I'll be honest. A lot of our methods don't seem to make sense to you, do they? Nope. We have the power to solve problems, why don't we? That's true. Well, I, underst I understand that concept. I've seen enough fiction stories to understand why you don't do that. I meant with the other wither storms people have dealt with in the past. I assume there's a limitation just to what you guys can do. From what I understand about weather storms, they're an inevitable end of the universe. Yeah. Yes. You guys. Yes. Like, refresh the heart. <laughs> like Nebula's voice just. She sounds like I would want to say a teenager. Or like an older woman. Are trying to stop it speeding up. Yes. Yes. <laughs> So, essentially, that's my nebula guys... um, impression. Yes. <laughs> yeah, I think I should definitely do a video of like me doing impressions of different characters. Can't be a vaccine, but you're just the suppression medication. That's, an that's awesome. a very fun <laughs> way of putting it. See, Lunar, this this will keep you alive. What, thinking like that? Yeah. I don't know, I guess... Ever since I, that thing with Eclipse happened, I guess I have understood what I can do. Every better. star explodes. Inevitably. It's what you do. Yeah. When you reform. Um... You know, you should probably talk to Earth. Earth? Want to be friends with her? There's things I can't even tell you, Lunar. I'd like to, but I'm not allowed to. Well, I'm not saying you have to give her information about this stuff. I'm just no, I'm not really allowed to talk to her anymore. Oh, how come? Oh. Maybe if you make a good impression on Taurus, though, that can be reversed. I'd like to talk to Earth Wait, again. Wait, does, does Taurus make up the rules? Who makes up these rules? Like, you're allowed to talk to Lunar, but not allowed to talk to Earth? Earth and Lunar, they're 
brother and sister, well, I guess, technically, um, great nephew and great aunt, technically, <laughs> but, okay, and they're your brother and sister, yeah, they're brother and sister, basically, or they're related, <laughs> I should say, to not make this any more complicated than it needs to be, but, yeah. They seem nice. I'll do my best. Yeah. I'd appreciate it. I'm sure you'll do just fine in there. You seem to have a good handle on yourself nowadays. Less cocky attitude. I'll be honest, you annoyed the hell out of me when I first met you. Yeah, I've... I've simmered down. down. Yeah, it's way better. I, re I kind of realized, uh... Emotion. Not necessarily the best thing in the world. I'll be honest with you, Lunar. You're kind of a complex being. You're from Earth. Emotions are supposed to be what Earthlings have. Mm-hmm. Yeah. The Astrals, we do feel, but not to the degree you feel, if that makes any sense. Yeah, yeah. I've noticed. It's complex to us, but you're a complex thing. And that's why it made you dangerous at first. I'm not sure if that's supposed to be a compliment or not. <laughs> you know? Because some people could take that as an insult. But now that you have a grasp on feeling, control of yourself, it's just being able to express yourself in a safe way. I mean, yeah. We'll say that waterfall wasn't always there. I think the waterfall was always there. Interesting. <laughs> that was more of target practice. I'd call it. I don't know. I, I don't know if it's because I'm from Earth or not, and that's why I have these weather powers, but I guess I feel a connection to natural phenomenon. It would make sense. Though I don't know, I'm just a messenger. <laughs> I don't know, I just... Also... One what? time when I was doing my meditating, I just felt the water in the mountain, and I felt it wanted to get out. Intriguing. I do hope if you make a good impression on Taurus, you can uh, explore those things further. Somebody tells me that Taurus can't come to okay. okay. Also, why does Lunar look like he has such a big head from this angle? Yeah, but is it just me? Or does Lunar look like he has a big head from this angle? I've been... I've been doing it small. I've changed... To start. I've changed some of the flower colors. I don't know. Interesting. Hey, I don't really know how I did that. I kind of just opened my eyes one time and a lot of the flowers were red. What on earth is going on? I don't know if you guys heard him, but a fire truck just went by. Hold on. Excuse me for a second. Hold on. Hold on. Owner investigation. Really? Yeah, <laughs> apparently that's what's going on. An owner investigation or whatever. I won't keep you forever, Luna. You can go ahead and do what you're going to do. I need to you're go and report fine. things. I don't mind talking to you. I know, but I have work to do. Yeah, I know. I'm only here to monitor you and report my findings back to those in charge. Well, if it makes you feel any better, I won't tell them that you and me talked, if you want me to. I'd appreciate that. Sure thing. I'll be able to let you know if there's anything else you need to say. I'm okay for now. Okay. 
If you ever want to talk in secret, let me know. I'm gonna try my best. Take by living. Doesn't have to be direct. Just do what you can. Yeah. Goodbye. Bye, my guess. God, that's weird. I forget that they can all teleport like that. Yeah. I think Caster explained that to me at some point. Like the taking a part of your matter with star power and then loading it. Yeah, yeah. It sounds painful. Tell me if I did it wrong. Yeah, I want to test that test it then. right now. Yeah. You should go talk to Earth about that, probably. Yeah, probably. Alright, super speed, here we go. Singing. <laughs> Hi. Hi. Uh, Why did Lunar act like a dog? <laughs> he acted like a little puppy. I mean, I guess Lunar is kind of like a little puppy in a way sometimes. I did a lot of running. Yeah. Why? <laughs> shot that C4 class from Staples. It's good to get some exercise, you know? Especially, uh, I heard you were doing leg exercises first before uh, going onto your arms. arms. Uh, just because I think it gets better to get like lower body strength before upper body strength. Cause yeah, I mean I recommend that because um the reason why I recommend it is because. Um, you know, you don't want your upper body to be heavier than your lower body, you know? Then I got oh. a visitor. Oh. The Gemini again? Mm -hmm. No. How'd that go? Mm -hmm. It was Nebula. Oh, Nebula? How are they doing? Uh, working. Oh, I see. I'm out of breath. Okay, I bet. How are you, everyone? Did you run the whole way? Yes. That's good. I also included his training. Cool. I'm good now. Does Nebula have anything to say about me? Um. Not to make it all about me. They wish they could talk to you more. Aw, I wish we could talk more, yeah. too. I get they're busy, though. Uh, they're also kind of banned from it. From talking to me? Yeah. Why? What did we do wrong? You didn't do anything wrong. It's, I'm assuming, star power law things. It's... I was told that if I make a good impression with Taurus, then maybe it could get, re like, the ban could get relieved. Well, then no pressure to you, but you better do good, buck buckaroo, buster. Well, I need to do good so I don't die. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Yeah, but also that. Well, to be fair, I was also told that the likelihood of him being able to kill me is pretty low. But there's still a chance. Yeah. Yes. So I was okay. told if I want to be scared, I still can because the chance is still there. Okay, well then, keep that in mind then. Sure. I'll be honest, these astrals, I, I feel like they have like a greater purpose in doing stuff. I don't feel like they go around bullying people willy-nilly without probable cause. <laughs> yeah. I don't know. I've only met Gemini and Nebula. Yeah, so. same. I don't know. I'm just kind of basing my assumption off of, you know, how I would believe they would work, you know? If well, yeah, I assume there's some logic behind things, but, you know, when you hear that two of them de destroy planets. Yeah. Kind of. Yeah. Yeah. Well, uh, what do I do now? With that information? Um, I don't know. I'm kind of just... So Nebula's been watching me intermittently between the last couple of weeks. Uh-huh. Which I found creepy. Yeah. Well, you could also say Gemini's probably watching you, too. Is that creepy? Yes. <laughs> 
I being can't... watched without your knowledge is weird. Yeah. Yeah, I guess it is. Yeah, I would just. Yeah, I guess it would be weird if Monty watched me. I mean, to be fair, if you think about it, we live in a place that has a bunch of cameras all around, so I guess we're technically always being watched. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. technically. And our lives are constantly uploaded to YouTube, so we're always being observed in that way too. Yeah. Yeah. Our lives are weird. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, your lives aren't the only one that's weird. Yep, your guys' lives aren't as weird as everyone else's. Everyone else's lives are weird. In some shape or form. Um. I talked to Nebula briefly about my power development, but... Because I have to report stuff, but uh, it's really it. it wasn't a lot. Well, that's still interesting to know, nonetheless. If yeah. Nebula's here, that means that Boris probably can't be too far from coming, huh? Yeah, they're watching me to report back, so that's where they went when they left. Me. Ah, I see. Well, we'll see when that happens. Yeah. Uh, we don't know when they come, so. Nope. I thought it was going to happen by now, but I'm assuming because Nebula's here, I'm assuming they're close. Yeah, you never know. Maybe they're already here and watching you. Maybe. Do you want to get some pasta? Ooh. Yeah. Uh, no, pasta sounds great. I have realized that when I use my powers, I get okay. hungry. Yeah. Seems to fit in. Can we get dessert Hi. pasta? I don't want dessert pasta. I mean, you can. I, I really want penne pasta with like Ooh. marinara sauce. Oh, I and love cheese. penne. You can Love have it. that. I have realized that after powers, I need sugar. Oh, okay. Oh, well, is, is that why Lunar loves Nutella? Because it's got lots of sugar in it? That must be why. <laughs> Pasta with marinara sauce, maybe perhaps meat sauce, Ooh. smothered in cheese. Have I told you that I've learned a weird thing about my powers? What is that? I feel almost connected to nature. Aw, I'm connected to you too, buddy. Get it? Because my name's Earth. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I blew a hole in a mountain. Oh, okay. That's quirky. Because, well, no, uh, because I felt that there was water that wanted to get out. Oh, the water was saying, hey, please let me out. That's cool. Well, not directly in words, but, like, I felt that there was a pressure that wanted to be relieved. That's cool. Yeah. I like that. I also changed the color of flowers. Ooh, I should have you come and visit me when I, want, when I have flowers, you know? I don't know how to do that, though. Well, then we can practice with my flowers. Sure. Ooh, I mean, yeah. I don't know which one's red. Oh, cool. I want pasta. Let's go get pasta. I'm hoping. Dessert I'm pasta. I love pasta. Pasta is my uh, second favorite Italian dish. My favorite being pizza. I love pizza. Also, here's a good question. What is your favorite kind of pasta? Like, do you like spaghetti? Do you like penne? Do you like macaroni? Do you like ravioli? Do you like... Is spaghetti as a pasta? You know, comment down below. What is your favorite kind of pasta? Or your favorite pizza? I love good cheese pizza. You know, cheese or pepperoni. But, uh, yeah, that's it for today's video. So hit subscribe and hit the to go see me on come below you to see some more of the Lunar No Show Ranch videos. I'll see you guys next video. Adios. Superstars.